Justin Cross online video, Frida Kahlo, action. Hi artists and crafts families, today's artist is Frida Kahlo. Frida Kahlo was a female Mexican painter. She is celebrated by her country and really the world as an icon of Mexican national tradition. This is seen through her bright colors, dramatic symbolism, and primitive style. Feminists celebrate her work for its uncompromising depiction of the female experience and form. She began painting when she was recovering from an accident and used art to help her get through the pain. In class, I turn all of our students' pictures into coloring book pages for this lesson so they can make their own self-portrait. If you'd like a photo of your child turned into a coloring book page so that they can make their very own self-portrait, we've added that option to our website. Today we're going to make a maraca. For this process, we will need one plastic egg, two plastic spoons, some unpopped popcorn kernels, <laughs> and duct tape. If you don't have the popcorn kernels, you can also use anything else that will shake like rice, or coffee beans, or the dried macaroni, dried macaroni, white beans, or anything else that will really make a noise. All right, so we're gonna start out by showing you how to make the basic maraca, and then we're gonna give you ideas so you can get creative and make it look a little bit more exciting, like this one, like the Mexican flag. Or like this one. Yeah. <laughs> Since this project was inspired by Frida, we decided to make a maraca that looks like Frida. All right, so we're gonna show you how to make the basic maraca now, and then we'll tell you the things we use to fancy ours up a little bit. Whoop, egg overboard. All right, so step one, open the egg. Step two, fill it with, ooh, nice use of the spoon, Georgia. And you don't have to fill it up to the top. Yeah, I almost I think, think like the less the better. Mm -hmm. Just one or two spoonfuls will do. All right, so now. And you can also like put some in and like close it, shake it, see if you like the sound, and if not, like when you take some out, put some in. So first, lay the spoon down, then put the egg in the spoon, then lay the other spoon on top of it. Now this is a little bit the tricky part. You're gonna rip, um, a piece of duct tape, probably about six inches or so, and then you're gonna wrap it around your head. And then kind of squeeze it in. Yep. Easy peasy. Um, so that's really it for the maraca. It's only a couple easy steps, and then you have a instrument to make some music. So now let's take it to the next level. So you could do that and leave it, or if you wanna add some washi tape, you could add washi tape. I'm gonna show you the other things we did. This one, we chose a fun decorative packing tape. Pinata. So for our pinata maraca, we use tissue paper and we cut little strips in it and use different colors so it looks like a pinata. To keep it on there, I just used scotch tape. So I started with the bottom layer and then went up. This one, I actually wrapped the washi tape around the stem of it. And then to get the two different colors, I took two eggs and I popped them open. And then I put this together like that. Frida! So for our Frida Morocco, we use cupcake liners to make her dress. We use tissue paper to make her crown of flowers on her head. And then we simply drew on her face making sure to include her beautiful unibrow. And since we're cheering for the doctors, we decided to make one that looked like a doctor. Another way to celebrate Frida is to make a maraca like the Mexican flag. So I just found a different kind of tape. This is electrical tape, this is duct tape, and then I think this is also duct tape, a smaller duct tape but you just layer it, up, layer it on. I started with the white, and then I added green to one side and red to the other. 
And since summertime is coming up, we made one that looks like an ice cream cone. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, this is fun to do if you're having a birthday party and you want to make um, a musical instrument for everybody there, or if you want to give gifts to your friends. Once you make one maraca, you're gonna to wanna to keep making more. It's kind of addicting, right? Mm -hmm. So if you're gonna make a lot, you might as well go into your friends and have a little celebration. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed these Frida-inspired maracas. We cannot wait to see what you come up with, so be sure to tag us on Instagram, at Artisan Crafts, or send me an email. I'm jack at lovejack.com. All right, happy creating. And have a little celebration. Why did I do that? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <Oop>. <laughs> Once you make one, 